Uh oh. Here's my haul. 49 cents for a tile to replace one tile on my trivet. Grocery haul. This is a chunk of meat. It is a, I don't know, cab rump roast? What is this? Rump roast something or other. And it was $16.82, but because it's close to the expiration date, it was $8.58. What I'm going to do is cut that up into pieces and grind it up and stuff like that and um, freeze it right away. It'll keep. Yay, hooray. Good savings. Then I got two pizzas, both $2 each. California Pizza Kitchen one and a freshetta. I'm going to have this freshetta for dinner, see what it's like. For $2, I figured, okay, I'll do it. Got some drawer organizer thingies to put my jewelry in. A $2 bag of corn chips. Five pound bag of carrots. I am going to be orange. Orange juice and milk. I've already had a couple pieces of this freshetta, multiple cheese, three cheese pizza or something. It said 425 degrees for 11 minutes. Well, in 11 minutes it didn't look done. Of course, it might be my little convection oven. So I let it go, probably went about 15 or 16 minutes. It got a little brown on one part there, but that's okay. It's not as crisp as I would think that it would be. It's kind of wimpy crust, but it has a good taste. And I'm very glad it was two dollars. And I calculated the money I saved. I saved just about as, I, you know, I paid about half the price on that beef as what they originally had on there. But like I say, I, I take it and I cut it up. I grind it or cut it up or whatever and put it in the freezer right away and it'll keep another couple months when it would be expiring on the 4th, whenever that is. What is it, when would that? One, two, three, four. Oh, tomorrow. <laughs> Thursday. So, uh, I found three, or was it four pennies? I found four pennies today. And I picked them up, too. And I don't care if they're facing up or facing down. It's a penny is a penny, and ten pennies is a dime, and keep going and keep going. I helped uh, my friend Kay clean blinds and put up curtains and stuff like that today clean windows and she gave me enough money to get some gas so now the car is full of gas my feet are hurting and my leg is killing me cat was mad because I left him alone today I'm gonna veg for a little while sitting here looking at stuff and look who joined me Today is Hug Your Cat Day, apparently, according to somebody somewhere. He's been so good today, haven't you? You were snoring away about a minute ago before I got the camera. We're going to try the other pizza tonight, aren't we? I started the oven to preheat. Are you my bubby? Huh? Yeah, you're my sweet pea. Yeah. He's loving on you, people. He's loving on you. Yeah. This one smelled really garlicky when I was cooking it. It doesn't look that hot, and it looks like where is the sauce? Like it might have been lightly sprayed on or something. Well, let's see if the cat likes it. Come here. What do you think? Is it cat approved or no? What do you think? Well, he likes it. I did take a lot of the pepperonis off 
it had a fair amount of pepperoni covering the whole thing. Uh, the fresh feta was pretty tasty. It didn't have hardly any sauce on it and had a thin wimpy crust as well. Which I should have used a little uh, cooling rack thing under it. But let's see what this one. I don't know. It's a lot spicier, more of a not so sweet. It's okay, but either one of those, a real Italian would say, what the heck is that thing? Once you've had a real pizza, it's really hard to eat this stuff. <laughs> Look at my friends coming to eat. Hi, Bun Bun. Look at the baby. There's a baby one. See the baby one? Isn't that neat? I was going to hang the clothes out, but I'm going to wait until they're done eating. Oh, hey, Bonnie Bun. So you had your babies, huh? I don't know where you live. Please let me know for before the next mowing of the grass. Yeah. This is Thursday and it uh, around here it's been like raining a little and then it stops raining and the sun comes out then it rains some more so it's like being in a terrarium <laughs> everything is green and the animals are all over the place and it's very very humid I hate humidity I hate it the pizza that we had was okay but I don't know also part of my tooth broke off when I must have happened when I was eating the pizza so I'm going to be missing another tooth eventually. This is a pain in the butt. It really is. I'm on here trying to catch up to vlogs and videos and uh, just checking things out here, there, and everywhere. <sighs> yeah. I actually had to close the windows up and turn the air conditioner on. Not to make it cool in here, to get the, the humidity out. I cannot function when my body feels like I'm wearing wet clothes. Mm -mm. I guess that's why I like mountains because the atmosphere is different. It's thinner and even if there's snow all around it doesn't feel like it. So you know, I'm living in the wrong place I guess. I have so much to do around here but it just, when you walk across the carpet and the carpet feels damp, that's how humid it is and I don't like it. So hopefully with some of the humidity out, I'll feel like doing something around here and really start getting things done. Tomorrow, for anyone that lives near a Dunkin' Donuts, apparently is free donut day. Just letting you know. I don't know if it's worth me getting up and going driving to get donuts. Or a donut. For free. Maybe. I could do that and get some gas in the gas can so I can mow the grass next week. Maybe when the grass dries out. <laughs> I'm sorry. This is a long vlog. Well, I don't know. Maybe something interesting will happen soon. I'll put it in onward. <laughs>